Happening today, the countdown clock is running. It's the kickoff to the NFL season tonight. The Broncos take on the Ravens in Denver. The Colts take to the field Sunday against the Raiders here at home at 1 o'clock. Fans are already getting excited. As Julie Persley reports, hundreds of them gathered on Monument Circle today for a special rally that helped the United Way. This is not only a big day for football fans, it's also a huge day for the United Way of Central Indiana. That's because this is a kickoff of the United Way campaign. Over the next year, it hopes to raise $42.5 million. Ah, what are you going to do? Fans join the celebration here on the circle. As a matter of fact, this is the fourth year the Colts and the United Way teamed up for the program. Fans got autographs from alumni Colts players. The cheerleaders were here. The United Way says this is a great way not only to get fans fired up for football, but also helping people here at home. This community has invested more than $1.1 billion since 1920 in the community through United Way. So we hold a very um, important and trusted position in this community, and we take that very seriously. United Way has been one of the longest standing partners we've had in this community, and obviously they do so much tremendous work, and so this is our way of, of kind of going together with them. The United Way also invited dozens of its partner agencies, hoping to inspire the rest of us to also get involved and volunteer. From Monument Circle, Julie Persley, RTV6. And to help celebrate the NFL's first game of the season, the Colts Grill downtown will be hosting a kickoff party tonight. Highlights include drink specials, ticket giveaways for Colts games, and Indianapolis Colts cornerback Greg Tolner will be signing autographs. Festivities begin at 7 o'clock. Then tomorrow night, the Colts are kicking off the season with a free outdoor concert downtown featuring the Gin Blossoms. It will be on Georgia Street between Capitol and Illinois from 6 to 10. The Colts cheerleaders will be there along with Blue. You can register to win prizes, and there will be giveaways and a beer garden as well. And if you want to go to Sunday's game at Lucas Oil Stadium, more tickets are now available. The Raiders have returned about 400 tickets. Other than these returns, the game has been sold out. Check at the Lucas Oil Stadium ticket office or Ticketmaster.